The Fletcher woman is fighting for her life. She was attacked by a pair of Great Danes. News 13's Ingrid Allstead joins us live from the Fletcher Police Department. Ingrid, the woman's injuries are extensive. She is currently in critical condition tonight, and police describe the scene as traumatic. If you head down this narrow gravel road in Fletcher, you'll find Great Danes inside a fenced yard contained in a kennel. <laughs> But it was this shelter Gail Lanning entered Monday morning, not knowing what would happen next. My aunt went over let my dogs out, and they didn't know her, and she said there were a black mare attacking her. They were great game. Went into the yard, and then went into the kennel to let the dogs out, and that's when they attacked her, from my understanding. Police say a neighbor across the street saw the Great Danes attacking Lanning. She called 911. Our officers got there and actually found the victim on the ground, and then... Um, identified that she needed assistance. The officers kept the dogs away from the 58-year-old victim until emergency personnel arrived. They were serious injuries that she sustained from the, the dog attack. <coughs> These are the animals police say mauled landing Monday morning, one male, one female. They are currently quarantined at the Henderson County Animal Shelter. I guess I worry. Dangerous. I guess I had to worry because we have to walk up here as a male. Neighbors we spoke with say they've never heard of previous attacks here, only heard a lot of barking. It's pretty bad because we have a lot of kids around here too. You know, young kids live here and uh, old people. Police say the victim lives nearby and the dogs belong to the victim's relatives. We wish, uh, you know, Miss Lanning and the rest of her family, we hope for the best and um, hope that she comes out of this. So it was traumatic. The owner of the dogs is cooperating with police. No charges are pending at this time. Reporting live in Fletcher, Ingrid Allstead, News 13.